Hey guys! Today I'm going to show you how to play Old School RuneScape aka OSRS in full screen mode in 2021. And if you've ever played Old School RuneScape you would have noticed that we can only play this in windowed mode and it's got that really annoying bar on the top there which says Old School RuneScape on it. And even if you are using the RuneLide client you will get the sidebar there and it's not truly full screen and if you were to use the full screen plugin it may not work properly for me I've tried everything but I just can't get that full screen plugin to work in Moonlight so today I'm going to show you how to be able to play old school RuneScape in fully full screen mode do make sure to hit that subscribe button guys and you will be kept up to date with any video that I post on here and you should be able to then record your gameplay or stream it without having to crop any of the sides at the top there in your video capture software and you won't even have to do it in your video editing software either because personally I have come across where I've had to use multiple files and I've had to crop each file and get rid of the top bars and the taskbar as well. Obviously you can hide the taskbar but it's still going to have the top bar there so it's, it's really a pain to try and get this to either record in full screen or even play in full screen. So hopefully using this method you guys should be able to play this game in full screen mode. Alright so as you can see I am currently in full screen mode and now I'm running this in windowed mode as you can see. So I have got the this is the default client where, which you can actually download from the old school RuneScape website and today I'm going to show you how to be able to play this version of the game in full screen mode and then I'm also going to show you how to play the RuneLite version in truly full screen mode as well. Unfortunately there are some problems with the Steam version of the game where the Steam overlay interferes with the software that you have to use to get it to run in full screen but to be honest the Steam version is not that great anyway compared to the default version I haven't noticed much difference the only difference the Steam version has is that it's got the 400% zoom in option and slightly better draw distance but to be honest if, you're, if you've played this before you'll find the default client that you can download from the old school RuneScape website it's, it's okay to play with so for me I would personally recommend that you either use the old school RuneScape default client that you can get from the website or you use the RuneLight version so it depends on your personal preference alright so now I'm going to show you how to play the default client in full screen mode alright so the first thing you need to do is if you open up your internet browser and in there if you start typing in Kasumil, which I've already got there, full screen Nizer, and it's normally the first link which comes up on the search result, which is the github.com search result there. So if we just click on that, and on the right hand side it says releases, so we click on this one, which is the latest release. And as you can see, this software was actually released on the 30th of March 2021, so it's fairly recent. And if you just click on this bit here, which says full screenizer version one dot zip and let that download. All right, so once you open the zip file, you will see this, this file here, full screenizer. And if you just drag this to your desktop or your C drive, it doesn't really matter. And then just close the zip file. So now we've got this application. And what you need to do is if you run this application, you will see this screen here. It will create a config file as well, as you can see over here. So this is really useful because every time you load the game, it's gonna know which application you're running so you don't have to keep on doing these things all the time. All right, so the first thing you need to do in this full screenizer application is to tick this box here, which says hotkey, because it's gonna make it so much easier because we're gonna use the hotkey control and the home button and that's going to make the application go into full screen or come out of it. All right, so now what we do is if we run the game, so I'm going to open up the default old school RuneScape client first of all. I'm just going to move this across so you can see both windows. All right, so now that you've got the 
old school RuneScape client open. If you click on this button here in, in the full screenizer application which says show all and then you select old school RuneScape and then click on add and then just close this down. So now you've got this old school RuneScape showing here in the apps section. Uh, let's log in. Let's go into the free world. Just type in my password there. All right, so as you can see, I'm now logged into the game using the default client. So now I'm gonna press the control and home button and it should make it full screen. There we go. So as you can see, I'm now running this in full, total full screen mode. And now if I press the control and home key again, it's gonna go back into window mode. So it's really simple guys. All you have to do is just run this application and if you were to click on this minimize button, it will go into your taskbar. So it won't be there to interfere with your desktop either. So I'm going to press the control home key again and I'm full screen again. And you can just carry on playing. All right, so now I'm going to show you how to do the same thing, but do it for Moonlight as well. And as I mentioned earlier, this may or may not work on the Steam version of the game. So if you do want to play on the Steam version, unfortunately, this may not work for you. But this will work on the traditional old school RuneScape client that you can download from the website. And it will also work with Moonlight as well. Alright, so let me just close this down. I am now going to run Moonlight as well. All right, so let me run that application again. As you can see, I've got it here. And because I've already done the show wall and selected room light and clicked on add, it's remembered my setting there. So it's, it's showing room light in the app section. And obviously we're making sure that hotkey button here, the check mark is ticked. All right, so let me just quickly log in here. Now, as you can see at the top here, I am running the Moonlight client. All right, so let me just quickly maximize this so I can show you something. So normally in Moonlight, it will have this sidebar here and chances are that the top bar here will also be in black. Now, what you need to do is you need to go into configuration, scroll down to where it says Moonlight click on this cog wheel here and you want to untick where it says enable custom window chrome by default this is going to be ticked so you just want to make sure it's unticked and there's no tick on this check mark and then you need to restart the game and once you restarted the game you'll notice that this top bar is a different color it won't be black color so that's what we need to make sure first of all secondly if you scroll down and look for where it says stretched mode, if you want to enable that plugin, and these are my settings for it, I've just ticked this box here, increase performance mode, and I've had this check mark ticked. So as you can see, these are my settings. All right. And obviously, if you just get rid of this sidebar, and what I like to do, I like to keep it in windowed mode, and then if I press control and home, it's going to make it full screen. So there we go. So I'm now running the Runelight application in truly full screen mode. I have found that if I run the, the plugin for full screen, I'll quickly show you over here. If I turn this on, it doesn't really work properly because when I click the full screen mode, it has this sidebar here and to get rid of it, if I click this, as you can see on the left hand side, I've got my desktop showing and it's just so frustrating. So yeah, I don't really like using the full screen plugin at all. It just doesn't work for me for some reason. So I found this method to be the best and easiest way to do it. So always make sure that this sidebar, if you click on this icon, it's disappeared. As I said earlier, I like to make it in windowed mode and then press control and home, which makes it into of the full screen mode there. Now. If you want to play using the classic 
layout. Let's just go to settings, all settings. And where it says game client layout, if we click on fixed classic layout, there we go. Now, if I press control at home, I'm running this in full screen mode and I've got the classic layout as well. So yeah, you can capture the gameplay. You don't have to crop it or anything, or if even if you record it when in windowed mode, you don't have to do any fancy editing in your editing software. You can just play it like this, and record it straight from the source without messing around. So as you can see, I'm running this in full screen and it looks quite nice to be honest. I've got the rune light plugins enabled. And this is why we enabled the stretch mode, which I told you about earlier, as you can see over here. And this is allowing the, the classic mode to run in stretch mode and it's stretching it to the screen. If you did try this on the default client, it won't work because it will be really small on your screen because of the resolution issue. So yeah, hopefully you guys have found this video useful. If you have, please give it a thumbs up. If you have any queries or you haven't been able to run this properly, or even if you have managed to run this properly, do let, let us know in the comment section below about your success or failure for this method. Hopefully it has worked for you guys. And please do sort of hit that subscribe button to help this channel grow and support it. And I'll see you guys next time. Thank you for watching.